about. I've showered, I feel good. We're gonna float all day today, tie about 20 or 30 rafts together and uh, just float along the lake. Oh, I fucked up. Lisa, let's go see what's for breakfast. I hope it's pork. I and a lot pork of it. Too. Bacon? Bacon. Bacon I makes it so. better. Let's go see. Let's go. Feeding 40 people isn't easy. It takes a team, dedication, and a lot of food. So after spending a nice day down on the lake, floating around on floaties, we're gonna go up to a cliff and celebrate the summer solstice. And it's gonna be a good view. So tonight's meal, pulled pork tacos. I'm heating it up right now. So we're heading up to the tunnel up in the cliff, which is right up there. It's really windy out here. They weren't lying. It's an actual tunnel. And apparently the sun is going to shine right through this tunnel when it's almost ready to set. But it's cloudy out and I don't see it happening at all. So why this tunnel is here, this path, I was just told that it was a railway way back when, Kettle Valley Railway, and it was used for transport all between the smaller communities all over the place here, but now it's the Trans-Canada Trail, and uh, which connects all across Canada actually, so this is part of it. Dance party in the cave but the sun didn't shine because the clouds were covering it. So we didn't get to see it go through. Maybe next year.